We begin with a breaking news alert out of Montgomery County. Multiple police departments are taking part in a manhunt for a kidnapping suspect. State police say the man ran away after they pulled over a car on Interstate 81 between Ironto and Christiansburg. 10 News reporter Tommy Lopez is live on the scene where he saw several police with guns heading into the woods just a few minutes ago. Tommy, what's the latest? Yeah, police have grouped up here on the side of Interstate 81. You can see the line of cars that extends down. This is going southbound on 81. You can see the officers that are right there, and many are in the woods here. This is going to the west, and you can see the rough terrain, the uphill slopes, the rocks and downhill slopes. At least eight officers in a state police tactical team have gone on in there. They've joined at least eight others. This is near mile marker 124, and police now have been searching for more than four hours after they pulled this man over. The state police tactical team first went in about an hour ago. Uh, there are officers from multiple departments that are here on the scene. Police say that this man is Jose Alberto Hernandez. He is wanted for kidnapping in Harrisonburg. He was in a car registered to a woman who lives nearby. They think he lives nearby, and they're questioning people where he works. Police say he could be close by here where they're searching. Uh, about an hour ago, they said he also could have escaped the perimeter. Officers say, though, he is not armed. I don't know that he's dangerous, but if it is the person we think it is, that, that gentleman is wanted for kidnapping out of Harrisonburg. Police say he's Hispanic. He is barefoot. He's wearing blue jeans. Officers took out two dogs, but that didn't help. They were not able to find him from that. Montgomery County uh, de Sheriff's deputies are here. Blacksburg, Christiansburg, police officers are here are as multiple departments have responded. Officers say they, they pulled the man over, they were talking to him, and when they asked him about that kidnapping charge, he just ran away. So that's the latest. We'll have updates throughout the afternoon here on WSLS.com. You can actually see right here part of the state police tactical team and Montgomery County Sheriff's deputies walking back here. We'll try to get an update from police soon. Live in Montgomery County, I'm Tommy Lopez, 10 News, working for you.